What up people, this is Bonjo. Today we're going to another grocery store here in Valencia. We're going to Europe's favorite grocery store, Lidl. It's kind of like the Walmart of Europe, except for you don't have all the things like lawn furniture and stuff, but you do have lots of like hardware tools and all that kind of stuff. But we're gonna go see if this Lidl is cheap like the one in Croatia, London, and across Europe, or is it expensive? So let us know if it's more expensive here or where you're from in the comments, right? Mickey, look at this. Lido. Are you excited? Not as excited <laughs> as me, eh? I don't know. I expect to find it uh, different yeah, items, these different products. I'm excited to see what they have to offer. Me, I love a good grocery store, especially a new one in a new country. I don't know why I like them so much, but I watch videos on them, I love doing them. Love going to them. So let's go to Lido. This is Bonjo. We took the wrong turn, but we're on the right track right now. La Nostra Tereta. We're on the right track. So let's go this way. By the Pizarro. We got a teddy here in Spain too. This is like Europe's Dollarama or Dollar Tree. It's a pretty cool store. We always used to, we always go in there and uh, split and Joker Mall. It's a good little discount store, bargain store. We're pulling up to Lidl now. This Lidl looks very Lidl. I'll tell you that. It doesn't look like a big Lidl like we're used to. But there it is. excited what's this store look how beautiful it is uh, it's crazy isn't it let's go to Lidl let's go check out some Lidl some grocery store all oh, these different huh so far we'll grab one of these we'll grab a little buggy why not look how busy it is it looks like it's packed here so far. Look, you got your baked goods as soon as you walk in. You don't want these kind of empanadas. You want Argentine ones, huh? Yeah. She wants the good ones. Yeah, it looks about the same, huh? Let's check out the pizza. It's two seventy nine a pizza. Not bad. I never buy these kind of pizzas, but that's not a. It's a fair price. Four ninety nine for mixed meat pretty good sushi 2.99 some sushi from Lidl I don't know you guys trust in that you guys trust the raw fish from Lidl I don't know about that let's check out this stuff do they got fruitishas for what some fruitisha five euros how do you know fresh fresh on can we have it for You want that one? Get a better one. Those are white. Yeah, we can buy some strawberries. Strawberries, I think, are out of season. That's why they're... Yeah, these ones look better. They, they look like they're uh, out of season, so they're pretty expensive here. Five euros for a bin of strawberries. What's this one? Is this squash? Uh, calabaza, yes. Squash. Oh, 189 for calabaza. Calabaza, I never knew that word, calabaza. Tomate, roja, zomo, some smoothies, huh? Some 179 for a smoothie, a kombucha. Not bad, not bad. Can I open now for him? I don't know. Maybe, if it's like Croatia, you can. If it's not like Croatia, we'll find out. They'll be like, you can't do that, it's too late now. But look at this, okay. Let's go here, we got papaya. $3.99 for a big papaya. That's not bad. All these mangoes aren't ready. It's $3.15. Pretty expensive, those. Oh, limes. $1.15. Not bad for limes. Lemons, same thing. $1.65 for a bag. Not bad. Not bad at all. $5.19 for an 
aguacate, aguacate, aguacate mala. So small ones. 149, not bad. 190. I never knew that was the name of avocados. Aguacate. Aguacate. Aguacate, eh? What's aguacate? Aguacate is uh, uh, avocado. That's crazy. But I never knew that. Mexican. Ah. Palta, yeah. I never, yeah. Why does it say aguacate, eh? Uh, it's crazy. In Spain, they also use aguacate. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. Look at that. The papaya is bigger than her head. She's loving it. <laughs> I'm used to do big things. Oh. But look at this. What's this one at? A melon, eh? 249 for a melon? 249 for an abuelo melon. A grand, a grandfather melon. Yes. A grandfather. Is the name. Yeah, that's crazy. Look at a piña. A piña is this one. Oh, piña this is a piña. It's only one twenty-five. It's it's not bad, eh? One twenty-five. And oh, the see? this one is the khaki that this guy has had. Yeah, they had khakis. How much is a khaki? Oh, right there. One eighty-nine. Pretty the cheap thing. for a bin of khaki. And look at you got your uh, jamón ibérico. 239 but it's probably low grade you got lomo duroch duroch yeah lunch meat is lunch meat here is pretty pretty good price yeah they love um lunch meat. jams and that kind of yeah lunch meat like yeah like they have so much selection of this lunch meat they have special places inside the store that they couldn't at the moment yeah yeah like in uh mercadona they have the but that's like that fancy, fancy, expensive stuff. And look at this, the seafood too. They always have tons of, tons of, tons of seafood, eh? This place, not so much. This is it, actually. And over here, I think, salmon. You got your salmon steaks and your salmon filets. Nine euros for a big piece of salmon. Isn't bad, isn't so bad. Isn't so bad, you got your hot dogs. Nobody's eating hot dogs around here, eh? Yeah. No. Uh, maybe, yeah. No, I mean, like us, our family. No, Let's check out this. Let's check out what we got here for the meat. The meat doesn't look so good. I'm not gonna lie, this this meat looks a little off, but it's 750 for burger meat. 735 I mean, so it's not so bad. But but beef here is pretty expensive, huh? Pretty expensive beef, but we got pocho, you got your season. Pachuga. Pachuga is the breast, right? Yeah, pachuga up there, that's 377 for two breasts. Two big breasts, that's not bad. You got a, a lead of the potion chicken wings. Uh, right here. Oh, oh, they call them alas, why? Alas? Yeah. Yeah, it's wings. Yeah, wings. Three, I thought a lead of the pocho. Alita is little. Ah, uh, little wings. And this so, the alas. full wings. Yeah, so it's 348, you got the whole, you got the whole thing together, see? And they're not separated, that's the best kind. That's the one you wanna buy. You wanna buy them together. Never wanna buy them cut, that's weird. And 350 for the little 400 grams. Uh, one kilo is seven six thirty nine. So that's not bad for beef. And if you want 500 grams of just beef, it's three forty nine. So it's pretty good. It's pretty fair price, I'd say. And then you got your already made hamburgers for two forty nine for two burgers. It's not a bad price, I would say. And cheese. Cheese is also another thing that's pretty cheap. Like 175 for cheese. This would go for four euros in Croatia. Four euros for a, a pack of pizza cheese. So it's way cheaper here. But then you got this kind of cheese. Like obviously, cheese is crazy. You can buy expensive cheese or cheap cheese for pizza. And we have a special ones. Look at this one with nuts. Little nut cheese. You can buy cheese with your nuts in it. How much is that one? $1.99. One up top. $1.99. Ah, one ninety nine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cream also cheese. But what are we buying here? We just have strawberries so far. So yeah, far, yep. I think we're going actually to go eat. I'm going to Taco Bell again. <laughs> we don't have Taco Bell, so I'm I'm taking advantage of it. Two fifty four gordita. What? Look at this. So you got a pack of beer here. It's either so the cans are 149 each and a whole 24 pack here. Look at this, 24 pack of beer for 13 euros. And that's cheap, I'm telling you, that's very cheap. 13 euros, that's pretty good. Especially 
What's on Galicia? Yes. Tres and then just the regular one. And what's this one? Alhambra. This yeah. one is Alhambra. And this one is Estrella de Galicia. Estrella Dam is another one. Yeah, so Estrella Galicia. They don't have the price for this one here. So no, this, this one, one is $13.99 and this one's a bigger box. This one's a tiny little box. Pequeño. Pequeño, but that's pretty good. 13 bucks for a case of 24 beer. Damn. Damn, that's good. And you got all your frozen stuff here. It's a little bit different. We got the, what is this? Foye y trufa. Trufa. Yeah, what's that? Canelones. Uh, oh, it's like cannelloni. Yeah, it's like the Italian cannelloni, eh? Yeah. I see it up top, yes. Marisco. What's marisco with shrimp? Yes. Yeah, seafood. seafood, yeah. Yeah, so you got all your seafood. Look at the prawns here. Look at that, lagostinos. Woo, those are big tiger shrimp. Jumbo, ten forty nine for a box though. That's pretty good. And what's this one? Crab. Crab. Look at that whole crab. Pretty good. A lobster too. You got lobster eleven forty nine, eleven nineteen for a lobster. Damn. Pretty good prices I'd say in here. Jesus. We thought it would be more expensive because it's a city. Yeah. The store is not the big one that is in the outside of the city. Yeah, but it's pretty good here I'd say. Look at that squids. Is it squid? Sepia Olympia with that squid? I don't know what Olympia is. What is that, eh? What's Olympia? But you got all, even this, you got razor clams. You got everything at this place. This place is good. I like this place. This place is good, but these guys are probably wondering why, why are we filming this, eh? That's okay. Okay, so we have to buy something for Nancy, for Precious. There is uh, the 6th of January, the three wise men come to your house and if you leave your shoes outside with some water and grass for the camels, they give you a present. And it's a traditional Spanish celebration and we have to do it for So since we're in Spain and we only have a backpack to bring, it's going to be hard for space. So let's try to get something pequeño. It's is pequeño. Estos pequeño. Oh, <laughs> the three wise men are cheap this year. Cheap, 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 cheap. I like this one. It's five euros. Five euros, not bad. Get it. You like that one or this one? This one is eleven. Yeah. I think. Let me see. Yeah, eleven. You go Morty Sana. Morty, what did no, it say? Montreal. Juego de motricidad. Motricidad, 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 I don't know what that is. Oh, we got these things too, Pop Funko Pops, $9.99, pretty good. $9.99 for a Funko Pop, you got the Harry Potter one. You don't want to get them this? Harry Potter, no? She doesn't like the old Funko Pops, the old Funkos. So here's a cider beer, you can get a, so this one's raspberry and apple. This one's 77 cents. You can get this one, Manzana. This one's also an apple. This one's a green apple cider. And this one's the Fruticia one again. So you got those for 77 cents a bottle. That's not bad again, not bad at all. Here's some churros, 119 for a bag of churros. All you have to do is heat them up and you got your own churros. And then you heat up some Nutella and you dip them in and you got your own churros, perfect. That's what's beautiful about coming to different supermarkets. Like, look at this, bacon paninis. You know, you get different things, little things that are different that you're not used to are amazing. It's my favorite part about going to a new country, trying food. Look at this, all the beer, the Amstel. Look at this. See, you can buy a whole piece of ham for 42 euros here. 42 euros for some Iberica ham. Hamoni Iberica, perfect, see that? Isn't that great? Look at this, some meat sticks too, for what, 119? Perfect, isn't it? 459 for some meat sticks. Damn, I'm gonna get some meat sticks, see? I hope you get a good idea of how much you can spend here and how cheap it is with this video, because it's pretty cheap, I'd say. You look at water, 21 cents for a bottle of water. Tell me, 73 cents for a bigger bottle of water. Wow, 21 cents for a baby water. Incredible, isn't it? It's cheap, 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 cheap. Eight, eight seventy nine for a bag of diapers. Eight, way cheaper, way cheaper than Croatia. I don't care what anybody says. This is great. 
This is our grocery store video at Lidl. How good is this place, right? Lidl, Europe's number one grocers. So we bought the strawberries, the toy friends on the Greek yogurt. And it all came to about, I would say 12 euros because the strawberries were pretty expensive and the toy was $5, so five, five. And I think the other one was, so it came to $12, right? 12, yes. 12 euros, yeah, so that was pretty, right? Pretty good, eh? 12 euros for those three things. We didn't buy much, but this is our time at Lido. And it was a beautiful little time, huh? What do you think about the prices overall? No, I'm, I'm surprised. If, it's a pity that we don't have it closer, but if I have Mercadona and this one, probably I will pick this one to come. Yeah, it's cheaper. It's cheaper for sure. Europe's greatest grocery store for sure.